Thank you for joining. This is Mark. This is part two of the Marley LLC liquid level control panel system. Part one covers the basic components of the system. Today we're going to do a quick overview again, but for more detail, please go back to part number one. This segment will be covering installation and startup and commissioning of the Marley LLC liquid level control panel system. Let's do a quick refresher on the major components of the water level system. The probes, which actually sense the level of the water, you have a probe set with 30 feet of wire, a stilling chamber, stilling chamber mounts in the basin of the cooling tower, on some configuration may mount on the outside of the cooling tower. The purpose of the stilling chamber is to provide a holder for the probe set and also to calm the waters so you don't get any erratic readings. Another major component, if you have a makeup card in your system, is an electrical solenoid here. Typically, you apply 120 volts to this. Solenoid opens, allowing water to flow into the cooling tower to make up water. The brains of the system is the control panel. Inside the control panel are various circuits. They're circuits for each level event. The probes communicate to the cards in the panel. That's how the cards know what the water level is and then they activate onboard relays on and off to perform alarm functions, to energize and make up solenoid. Along with each panel, you get two real nice user manuals showing all the wiring diagrams of the available configurations, troubleshooting charts in here, descriptions of the product, and also valuable here is the wiring diagram that is on the door. There's also a lot of good information on that wiring diagram. 